Hello everyone. Uh, in this scenario, I want to show you how eye offensing can be used uh, to avoid split brain condition. Uh, first of all, uh, what is split brain condition? Uh, whenever the communication uh, between two cluster nodes, uh, I mean the heartbeat connections, completely fails and there is no way uh, that uh, each uh, cluster node can communicate with other cluster node then uh, every node in the cluster will uh, form as a mini cluster and uh, try to get the control of uh, cluster resources uh, and uh, and possibly they will cause the data corruption and uh, this situation is called split brain uh, situation in this post i want to uh, simulate that uh, split brain uh, situation and uh, so that we can see how uh, normally a cluster behaves uh, without IO fencing and then I'll, I'll, I'll show you how to configure the IO fencing so that we can see how IO fencing can uh, deal with the split brain uh, condition okay uh, right now uh, you can see my cluster setup I have two nodes uh, Gurukul VCS1 and Gurukul VCS2 and uh, this is simple NFS cluster and uh, I'm using shared disk from Gurukul SAN device and these are uh, ISKC devices Okay, if you see my cluster uh, over you, this is node 1 and this is node 2 and right now the NFS uh, group was available on Gurukul VCS 1. Uh, now what I am doing is uh, I just want to break these two heartbeat connections so that these two cluster nodes will behave uh, as individual mini clusters and uh, it will possibly cause the split brain condition and uh, we'll see how the cluster will uh, appear after the split brain okay now i disconnected the heartbeat connections now there is no communication between gurkul vcs1 and gurkul vcs2 and let's see how it appears uh, uh, in the cluster side It will take a few seconds to update the status okay now we got it uh, the Gurukul VCS 1 I mean uh, the first node is uh, finding the Gurukul VCS 2 as faulted and it took the con complete control of uh, Gurukul VCS 1 and, uh, and it is uh, already available there so it, it was still online there and uh, we will see how uh, the second node is uh, looking at the resource if you see here clearly, uh, Gurukul VCS2 says that VCS1 is faulted and so that it is trying to start the NFS resource on top of VCS2. Whereas we know that VCS1 is still having that resource online. That means this uh, Gurukul VCS2 is trying to bring up the uh, disk group and whatever it is and it will try to uh, do the further operations whatever we mentioned as part of cluster. So that will cause the possible data corruption. Okay, uh, now we know that uh, the split brain condition is uh, dangerous and it can uh, create real problem to the production clusters. Now I will show you how to configure the IO fencing to avoid the situation and uh, then we will again check the split brain condition and how it uh, uh, behaves uh, when we configure the IO fencing. 